Hello, in this video we're going to show you how to change the baud rate of a HC06 Bluetooth module which has a XB uh, pins uh, by using the ArduSimple uh, Ublox F9 board, GNSS board. So we want to turn this board into a Bluetooth GNSS receiver where you can connect it to Android by using apps. So the problem is that the baud rate here, the default baud rate here is 38,000 something and here is 9600. We want to change it to match. The default baud rate here is 96,000. So we need to change this. There's a Spanish website saying uh, how to do this is that you need to connect this module here and then use the power plus XB, power plus XB uh what to connect to the computer okay so let's do that okay so i've mounted the xp bluetooth hc06 module to the other simple board so i connect the usb so it'll connect to my computer oh one minute okay i've connected it to my computer and then let's start uh, the Arduino program so uh, here I start the program we're not going to code anything we're just going to use the serial monitor to change the baud rate so you just make sure that the device is connected in my case before connecting the module there was only up to USB 4 but here there's TTY USB 5 so it means this is the new one it's already checked here so it's auto connected in your case if you use a Windows computer it will be COM port so you look for the latest COM port that appears after you inserted the, the, the USB to the XB port on the other simple okay so we go to serial monitor we want to check the, uh, by default the baud rate that uh, the HC06 comes with is 9600 we can know that from the from the uh, data sheet so uh, again thanks to the writer of this this article which told us that we can use the power plus XP port to configure the baud rate okay we can just search you can just search Google for HC06 data sheet PDF and then you'd get uh, the data sheet which says that by default the baud rate is 9600 okay and you must send the uh, AT in, in, in capital okay I tried in lowercase nothing nothing happens so you need to be in capital and no line ending okay and uh, correct baud rate which that came from the factory so you say AT just to test first okay it says okay you can try AT again it says okay again if suppose you choose a wrong baud rate suppose you sh it came like this and then or maybe the seller already used another baud rate already changed the baud rate for you if but it's suppose it's not correct you say AT and nothing will happen there will be no OK response from the device so you need to be in the baud rate that was last set so you will get the OK response okay so now we want to change it if you don't want to change the, the, the baud rate in, in U center you can choose this baud rate right 38400 because that's the default in in the mod that comes from the module but you can change that in U center UART2 in the configuration view of U center you can change it to 57600 or whatever but in my case uh, I'm going to use 57600 you might want to use 38400 if you don't want to change things in U center but in U Center, I want to change, so I want to enable UBX and RTCM for for the UART2. So I'm going to change this anyway. 
to 57600 like in the Spanish uh, guide okay so the code here is 7 I need to change 80 plus board 7 in my case because I want this board rate so let's go to my okay so I just press 80 plus B A U D 7 okay and it says okay 57600 so now the baud rate is changed to 57600 if I say AT again let's say okay nothing happens because it's now talking at 57600 already okay so the we go to 57600 and then let's say AT just to test that it works it says okay so means this works now so important thing is that mine is a HC 06 you don't need to connect uh, you know the pins as in the in the Spanish side that is for the HC 05 but important thing is that Bluetooth should not be connected so it will be in AT command mode it, not connected means it's blinking like this means Bluetooth is not connected so you can talk to it in AT command mode as what we did but if it's not blinking means Bluetooth is connected you will not be in AT command mode okay so that's that's all all there is to to this setting the baud rate setting the baud rate is done now you can disconnect and connect again to to make the settings take effect okay I disconnect and connect again okay so now it's it's ready next step uh, you might need to go to U center connected by USB by connecting to this this port to change the baud rate in U center if you want if you are not using 38400 right or do other settings in U center remember to use uh, the configuration view uh, CFG to save the settings flash to device here. otherwise it it will it will restore after you power off the device okay thanks for watching goodbye have a nice day